some days, I remember to thank the Lord that he made me a father of two beautiful daughters. And some days, I'm just thankful the Lord gave me the financial leeway to buy my daughter a bike. And one day, I found out she could ride it. She rode her bike with such courage that she could be any 10-year-old boy's ride or die chick. After numerous falls and countless calls of, Daddy, don't let go, she finally let go of her insecurities and pedaled as fast as she could as if her life depended on it. And it did, because a child's life is marked by their ability to conquer their world. Growing from a baby to a young girl, my baby girl doesn't only want to dress up in diamonds and pearls. In fact, she tries super hard to do this thing called a pirouette, which I think is some sort of ballet twirl. You see, children are driven towards a greater sense of independence. From their first stages, it is written in their biological pages to understand themselves, their surroundings, and how to manipulate their environments. And they continue to gain greater ground of how the world is really at their fingertips if they only knew how to harness it, garnish it, and then proceed to varnish it like a trinket given from an elderly relative or a locket passed down from grandparents' pockets and a parent's job is to never let their child become one who is ignorant of the simple fact that life has many challenges, but with patience, persistence, love, and faith, she could go anywhere, do anything, and the expanse of earth will be her escape, so no matter where she travels, no one could call her an immigrant. And after watching my daughter blaze up and down the laneway with such determination, it only took me a few considerations to make like Beyonce knows and take her beyond her goals with an upgrade to a new used bicycle with a slightly larger frame and no training wheels. And when I bought that bike home, hoping it was the right size, I walked upstairs, woke her up, took her outside and yelled, surprise, you should have seen the look in her eyes. She gave me the biggest missing front tooth smile about a mile wide. It's a feeling that can't be compared to none, except for the time when the Urban Legend Slam Finals was done. She jumped into my arms, crying, whispered in my ear, Daddy. You see, the reality is, I will be a father for the rest of my life. And along with my wife, we have both found profound joy in providing our children with their universal rights, the right to be loved and the right to be hugged, the right to eat sweets and the right to muddy feet, the right to be fed and the right to a warm bed, the right to play tea, but the most important of these is the right to be free. Free as the glee I see spread across your glowing face. It's a scene that I've seen from witnessing the vastness of the seas and gazing up into never-ending space. It is why I named you Husnia, a name that means youthful beauty. So that everywhere you go, your enchanting presence will remind people to be young at heart and to live with grace, a name that accentuates your inner beauty. As a strong-willed woman with a heart like an oven, yet still a hijabi, a name with dignity. So that whenever flagrant men step to you, it will be their duty to treat you with royalty. And even though I may have missed many of your creeping, crawling, running, walking, jumping days, I hope that in some small way I have made it up to you in being by your side when you earned your stripes on your bike. Some days, I remember to thank the Lord that he made me a father of two beautiful daughters. And some days, I'm just thankful the Lord gave me the financial leeway to buy my daughter a bike. And I pray that you continue to live free with no human ever stealing your shine. Because my beautiful daughter, it doesn't matter who you run off with in your lifetime. The memory of you riding your first bike will always be mine.
Kom ons nie ja. Sylvika. Kom baby. Kom. Uh, Alright, we'll be right back. She just threw up. Okay, welcome back. Oh, we have someone joining us. Yay. Hello birthday girl. Here's with me at the birthday girl. You're one years old. With Nia is one years old. Come. I'm gonna go on this side and you have to walk to me. Come. Go with me. Hi baby. Look at you laughing. Hi. What did you find? Oh. Hey. Yellow girl. Oh, baby. She's walking so fast now.